Hey man, welcome to another episode of Rockstar Rants, episode seven, China Mac versus Nina Boy. Can we all just get along? If you don't know, I'm your host, Rockstar 2800, host of Rockstar Rants and Rockstar Reactions right here on my page, Rockstar 2800. Make sure y'all tune in. So today we're talking about China Mac and Nina Boy. I got the pleasure of knowing both of these gentlemen, and I'm just trying to get to the middle some middle ground, some middle ground somewhere because they're both uh, intelligent men. They both speak. I'm waiting for this airplane to go by. They call for that. I live right down the street from the airport, so I'm gonna hear a lot of planes. But that, so they both gentlemen, man. They both speak um, great perspectives from both cultures. Um, yeah, let's get down to it, man. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, like, like, share the stream, go crazy, share this video. Um, yeah, man. So I'm going to take it back to No Jumper News with Brick Baby, myself, Poetic Flacco, and uh, Rob City. We were reacting to Bosco sitting down with China Mac on Mac Talk and Bosco was showing China Mac Nina Boy. Now Bosco, you know, he trolls Nina Boy all day, man. You know, these two gentlemen had the chance to get in the ring and didn't do nothing. Nothing didn't, didn't hit a fly. So for me, when I'm watching this video and he's telling about Nina Boy and he's making jokes, I'm like, boy, you want to talk, Bosco. You is one to talk. But that's another story. So China Mac kind of like, you know, entertained it. You know, spoke up on Nina during that sit down with Bosco. Nina saw that. Perfect opportunity. I'm going to start saying something back. He said some very disrespectful stuff back. We was rolling, laughing. But I don't agree with none of it. I mean, a joke is a joke, right? Who's not going to laugh? But it was disrespectful. It was disrespectful. So China Mac comes back. China Mac comes back. He gets disrespectful. So now they saying it's a fight on the line. It's a fight online. It might be a fight. We're trying to figure it out. So I think for like a week, it started dying down. I ain't hearing nothing about it, right? It's been a lot of stuff going on. Uh, it just kicked back off with the whole Charleston White China Mac situation. If you don't know, Charleston White went on a rampage, rant. Um, I don't even call it a rant. I call it a hateful speech. That's what he was speaking. He was speaking hateful speech about China Mac's culture. See, and, and, and my thing is, it's one thing when you talk about an individual, but when you bring their culture, their family, women and men involved, kids, kids are off limits. We don't do kids. I don't agree. I don't agree at all. This is not a race thing anymore. Unfortunately, because now you're bringing other people into it. So here we are, Nina Boy, China Mac. We back at it. China Mac been going hard on the IG, posting all type of, to me, okay, this is where I'm getting at. China Mac is trying to overprove himself that he that he messes with black people, that he that he's cool with black people. He has no problem, right? He's overproving that. I mean, with post after post. Hold on. They call today. I 
stay cold today, boy. Come on. So, yeah, China Mac is kind of overproving himself on IG, posting a lot of posts that have to do with uh, black and Asians, basically saying he's trying to he's trying to give you two different perspectives. He's trying to give you perspective. OK, Asians can't, you know, have done stuff to black people, but that's not all Asians. But then black people have done stuff to Asians. So it's, it's fair game, kind of like I, I get where he's coming from and. You know, but, you know, I was on live with that man and um, he had this gentleman on there, cool gentleman. And the gentleman was telling him, China, man, you don't have to do this. You don't have to prove yourself to nobody. He said, I've been out there with you. I done been in the field with you. I, 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 I done seen your friends, people you grew up with. They're black. He was like, I seen you in the trenches with the killers. I, I, I was I was over there. I, I know your upbringing. You know, he kind of insinuated that China Mac is the black sheep of his culture. He's the outcast because he embraces African-American culture. What's wrong with that? I see nothing wrong with it. Some people might, though. It's okay. We're going to get to that. And then Nina Boy. Uh, I had the pleasure of going on Nina Boy's YouTube live the other day. And when I mean they go crazy over there, they go crazy. Um, I was trying as much as I can to back China Mac. But to challenge Nina Boy thinking and everybody else on the panel. Because they was trying to compare him to like an old Chinese lady that owns a liquor store or owns a nail store. Like, we can't do that. This is a man of the culture, regardless of what you want to say. You know, they saying, um, he, well, we don't have no proof. He grew up with no brothers. And listen, we don't have a proof of a lot of you niggas street records. Let's keep it real. We don't know what y'all done done in these streets. So for you to say we have no record of him growing up black, I, I, I just didn't agree with that. Feel me? I just don't, don't agree with that. It's just, it is what it is. People say what they want to say, right? But the facts is, these men, like I was telling Nina Boy, like, y'all really need to sit down. Y'all really need to come holler at each other and chop it up and debate and have a strong conversation and maybe monetize off it, right? Because all this is going to turn into a bunch of rhetoric that nobody cares about because nobody's doing nothing to solve anything. How you solve it is face the problem head on. Y'all got an issue with each other, let's chop it, let's debate. Let's do YouTube. Let's conversate. Let's monetize from both of our channels. Something like that. Like, let's let's set it up. Let's really get some dough off this. Because y'all both have great perspectives. Great opinions. You know? And, and, I, and I would hate for it to lead into something else. Or start race riots or whatnot. So, hey, man, I'm reaching out to me and boy. Trying to make, man, I hope y'all can coexist with each other on these same platforms without spreading hate to each other. And that's coming from Rockstar 2800, man. Um, I got mad respect for China Mac, mad respect for Nina Boy, man. So hopefully y'all two gentlemen can come together and really chop it up and really get some understanding. If not understanding, uh, resonate with each other a little bit. And go y'all separate ways. Agree to disagree. It's okay. But what we're not going to do is we're not going to put each other races down, culture down. We're not going to discredit anybody's street uh, 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 stripes or uh, 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 whatever they've done in their past. Like, let's not do that, man. We better than that. 
So yeah, man. I, I hope y'all listening and watching. I hope y'all subscribe. Every comment count. Make sure y'all like this right now. Share this video. I'm Rockstar 2800, and this is Rockstar Rants. Y'all know what time it is. Tune in.